they're all sensory based descriptions. So let's have a look. What we can see there is we can say, see there's more lines on the photo on the left and there's no lines on the photo on the right. Can you see that there? It's quite obvious now, isn't it? Wonderful. We can also see difference in the eyebrow. On the right hand side, there's a deeper line. Can you see that? Photo on the right, there's a deeper line just there on the eyelid. What else can we see? We can see on the photo on the left, there's less shine on the nose. And on the right hand side, we can see there's more shine on the nose. Can you see that? Nice and shiny. What else can we see? On the left hand side, on the cheek, there's no line. On the right hand side, there's a deeper line. Can you see that now? These are all things that you can see and validate with your senses. Have a look at the difference between the lips. On the left hand side, there's lines. And on the right hand side, there's no lines. Very good. Caroline, lips look curled up. Yes, on the left, the lips are curled up. Wonderful. You can see that. And the enlarged iris. Yes, excellent. Shervy, on the right, deeper laughing lines. Well, all I want you to do, Shervy, is deeper lines because laughing is an interpretation. It's a guess. It's a mind read. We don't know if she's been laughing or not. But to say there's deeper lines, you can see that with your senses. Okay, very good. So let's review again. This is what we can look for. We can look for the skin color. Is it lighter or darker? The skin tone. Is it symmetrical or not symmetrical? We can't see the breathing. We can see the lower lip size. Is there lines or no lines? The eyes, are they focused or defocused? Are the pupils dilated or 